Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Podcast YouTube channel. I am your host, the Honorable Greg B, and it is Sunday, so that means it's time for more football Sunday. I know it's the off season, but hey, football never ends on the One Man Renegade Podcast YouTube channel. All right, today we are continuing on with 1999. Uh, we got top season opener. So I wasn't really familiar with this product, but I saw it. I was like, hey, what is this? I guess this is the equivalent of like Topps opening day would be for baseball. It's kind of the same idea um, that they put out in 1999, which is that pre-day opening day? I don't remember when opening day first started for Topps when they start doing that product. I don't really remember. But anyways, same idea. Uh, but if you missed any of the previous uh, 1999 or years before football boxes, go check them out up there. Uh, while you're at it, head on down, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you're new to the channel, the notification bell so you know when my videos drop. Hit the thumbs up because you like this video. Hit that share button and share it with everyone you know, especially if they're football fans. Head on to the comments, say hi. Uh, tell me if you ever remember this product from back in the day. I think they only did it for a few years, but, uh, you know, it's kind of the I, same idea as opening day. Uh, cheaper product, retail product. Um, and then check out the links in the description for blog, my blog, pod, pod, my blog, podcast, and other social media, if I can talk. But anyways, um, yeah, so I mean, not a kind of a lower end product, um, you know, uh, similar to opening day. Uh, it does have some rookies in it, though. So we got, we're looking for McNabb, Torrey Holt, Champ Bailey, Ricky Williams, among others, uh, also stars and Hall of Famers and stuff. There are 24 packs, seven packs, seven cards per pack. So sticking with that same idea of opening day, I believe opening day has seven cards per pack as well. So we'll see what, and they have the same like design as tops, the same, same tops design. Um, this is a weird box though. I, I, that was this, that, this, that was kind of the most confusing thing. I was like, what is this box? Like, what is this? It's like, a, it's like, it's like a sticker thing. You're supposed to. I don't know. I mean, it's made for retail, so I guess, like, you hang it up. It's it's kind of like a hanger box that you hang up on the wall at your store, I guess. I don't know. It's kind of weird, but then there's, like, a stand on the back, so I guess you could stand it up. I don't know. This is, yeah, like, what is this thing? Like, I guess you can stand it. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, you can stand it up like that if you want. If you don't want to hang it on the wall. And it stands. All right. Let's get into it. Um, we got 24 packs, so we'll do six today. And then six next week, and so on and so forth until we're done. All right, we got uh, Doug Flutie on the cover back when he was with the Bills before he moved on to San Diego. Uh, after he came over back from uh, uh, this, where was he? he was in Canada for a while. Um, of course, he got benched. And then the Bills lost that playoff game, and then he went on to San Diego. All right, I don't know. He kind of, like, he had a weird career because, like, he would start some games, and he'd do well for a little bit, and then they get benched, and then... So, what we're looking for? Autograph cards. One seven thousand hundred and twenty-six. I didn't even see a checklist for autograph cards when I was looking this up, so I don't even know. Uh, but you can win a trip to the 2000 Pro Bowl, so that'd be pretty sweet. Um, look for random lands. Oh, autographs of... Oh, Peyton Manning and Tim Couch. Oh, maybe I did see that, actually. Yes, never mind. I did see that. So, Tim Couch or Peyton Manning. Which one would you rather have? Um, odds of getting it aren't great, so I, I'm not even going to worry about it. But um, see if we can get some of those rookies, get some of the Hall of Famers, see what we can find. I'll also take a look at the um, design, because I've never opened any 99 tops. So, I don't... I mean, I'm guessing it's the same. They just have the little foil in the bottom like that. I don't know. Or maybe they're a different color. I don't know. I, like I said, I've, I don't think I've ever seen 99 tops football, so I can't really say. But we started off with Randy Moss, so that's pretty cool. Obviously, um, Hall of Famer. He's in the Hall of Fame already, right? Or it will be. No, I think he already went. I can't remember now. But clearly Hall of Famer. Uh, we got Darnay Scott, Pete Bolware, Trent Green, uh, Rag, Raghib, Rahib Ismail, Rocket Ismail, as people uh, may know. Kevin Johnson, a rookie draft uh, draft pick card. So we'll throw him on down there. Uh, Michael Sinclair. And then we got Football Fever, Terrell Davis. I think that's some, is that an ad or something? I'm, I'm confused. And then uh, another ad. So a couple ads. Well, does that count as a card? One, two, 
three, four, five, no. So this was just an ad. Okay, I was like, what is this? All right, moving on. Next pack. Uh, yeah, so like, I don't know. I mean, I don't think they, they only did this for a few years. So I'm not sure. I guess it probably didn't sell well. I don't know. I mean, they keep on doing opening day for um, baseball. It seems like a good, I mean, I know they're not doing football cards anymore, but this was 20. Two years ago we're talking about they could have kept making this for a number of years but they stopped they only as far as i know they only did it 8 98 99 2000 from what i could see junior sale hall of famer uh rest in peace also we got uh ricky dudley stephen boyd tony gonzalez uh he's going he's hall of fame i can't remember who's in the hall of fame already and who's going in the hall of fame but either way tony gonzalez hall of famer freddie solomon there's doug flutie throw him on down i don't think he's in the hall of fame or anything but should be. He's in the the BC Alumni Hall of Fame, I'm sure, and the Natick Alumni Hall of Fame. Uh, there's McNabb. There's the there's a rookie card we were looking for. Uh, no, uh, yeah, these are just ads. So okay, cool. Um, yeah, Doug Flutie from Natick, which is a couple times for, over from me. I know some people from Natick, so shout out to my Natick friends. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Doug Flutie. He's got a little treat named after him that goes by the the um, movie theater out in, uh, well, Framingham technically, but whatever. Uh, Jamal Anderson, uh, Jake Reed, Kevin Green, unfortunately passed away not too long ago. Emmett Smith, there he is, Hall of Famer. Jim Harbaugh, and then we got Cecil Collins draft pick card. Uh, I'll throw him on down with a Kevin Johnson. And then Garrison Hurst rounding things out for that pack. All right. I got some Foodie Flakes once, I remember. And then Gronk did the same thing with the Gronk Flakes. I think they were basically they were basically just Frosted Flakes, the same thing. Uh, Charles Wooden. Uh, Charles Woodson. Uh, Charles Woodson. Um, yeah, throw him on down. I think he... Does he? I feel like he just made the Hall of Fame too. Jerry Rice, obviously a Hall of Famer. Dan Marino, Hall of Famer. It's tougher to know because, like, in certain sports, it's like in baseball specifically, it's like very, it's like a big deal that people aren't in the Hall of Fame. Where like football and basketball and like hockey, it's just like I assume everyone's in the Hall of Fame. I don't know. Drew Bledsoe, I don't think's in the Hall of Fame, but he's in the Patriots Hall of Fame, so I'm gonna throw him on down there. Priest Holmes. He had a pretty decent career. I, I remember he had one huge game where he ran for, I think, over 200 yards. Uh, Warren Moon, uh, Charles Johnson, or maybe, I forget, maybe like 260 yards or something crazy. Um, and then I know Adrian Peterson broke the record. I forget what it is. I think he still has it. I don't think, I don't know. No, no, I don't, no, I'm not sure. Record for yards in a game. Look it up. For rushing yards in a game. I know Peterson had it, and I feel like he both broke Priest Holmes' record, who had broke Corey Dillon's record, but I don't know if anyone's broken his record. Robert Brown, uh, Robert Robert Brooks, Chad Brown, uh, Vonnie Holiday, Bill Romanowski, Musim 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 Muhammad. Uh, we got Jerris McPhail, expansion draft. Oh, yeah, the Browns were back again. I always forget that. The Browns went away and then came back again. It's weird, though, because they never, like, talk about that. They always, like, kind of, like, gloss over that and, like, talk about, oh, the Browns, blah, 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 blah. And it's like, yeah, but the Browns have only been around since 99, technically. If you want to talk about the Browns' Browns, they're actually the Ravens, and they won a couple Super Bowls. So it's like, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I know... There was lawsuits and stuff, and they kept the history, and the Ravens were kind of treated as a expansion team. But it's like, they that was the team, though. It's like, how can you consider this team that team when the whole team left? All right, we got Dante Culpepper draft pick cards. So that's a pretty nice one. I'll throw them on down there. John Lynch. Um, Fred Taylor. Uh, we got Yancey Thigpen. Um, so a little bit of stickiness, but not too bad, and no paper loss that I've noticed. Uh, Shannon Sharp. Like, again, Shannon Sharp. He Hall of Famer? I think so. I don't know for sure. Bruce Smith definitely is. But then if he told me he wasn't, I'd be like, oh, really? That doesn't make sense. And then Kerry Collins, uh, transactions card. So, 
All right, that's going to do it for today. Uh, good talk. We had some good talks. Uh, Doug Flutie, Flea Flakes, I don't know. Uh, season opener, 1999. That's all we got for six packs. It's nice cards. I do like these cards. Um, I don't, like, again, again, I've never opened 99 Tops football, so I don't. They, it says it's the same design, just it's got the season opener stamp, but I feel like maybe they were a different color, too. I don't know. You tell me. I don't know. Maybe if I get a box of tops, 99, I'll open it up. But I don't have it, so I don't know. But anyways, that's going to do it for today. We did pretty well. We got the McNabb. We got Culpepper. We got Elway, Marino, Emmett Smith, Moore Moon, Tony Gonzalez, Randy Moss, Doug Flute, Coverboy. All right, so come back next week. We'll do more of these packs. Come back every day. I've got videos posted every day, but Sundays are football Sundays. Um, so, yeah. So thank you everyone for watching. Stay safe, have fun, and we'll talk to you next time. Bye.